Hey, lovely people, this is Dee from Rock Paper Fitness, your local fitness and fat loss expert in Mobile, Alabama. Today's video is going to be about staying focused on your fitness goals and how to be most successful. I have a mentor named Bedros Koulian who is super amazing. He's a great fitness marketing guru, expert in the industry, and he did a video about um, a straight line to success as it pertains to business, okay? And it really spoke to me because a lot of times we get off track on what our goals are and we go all over the place trying to get to one destination. So I wanted to flip that and kind of give my clients and even you if you're on your fitness journey and um, insight on how to stay focused and how extremely vital it is for you to do that. So here we go. You are here, okay? So this is the beginning of your fitness journey. Not sure if you can see that, but it's a circle, okay? This is you, all right? So happy, so happy. And you want to get here. You might want to lose a little weight. You might want to tone up. You might want to get your tummy flat for the spring. You might want to gain some muscle. Um, you might just want to be healthy. But either way, you want to get from here to here, all right? This right here should not take you long, depending on how much weight you need to lose. Um, if you need to lose 100 pounds, it should take you a year. If it's just 30 pounds, maybe just four or five months. Oh, got it back. Maybe just four or five months. If it's just 10 pounds, two months, okay? So just think, I may want to lose, let's say, 15 pounds. I'm going to give me a long-term goal, let's just say, of three months so I don't get too stressed out about it. So I'm here, I'm super happy, and I sign up for a gym membership and I start here. Now, the gym membership's going well, I'm going, 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 but then my friend says, hey, I want you to try this product. So I get distracted and I go all the way up here, all right? So I tried this product, it's getting me going, the product is great, and now I'm back here on this line to success. Cool, well, your schedule's kind of iffy, and you're like, I'm just going to do this product. I'm just going to go, 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 and I'm going to stop coming to the gym. All right? Does that sound like anything that's familiar? I know we've all been through it, okay? So I'm going to stop going to the gym. So you just stay here for a, a couple weeks, and then you run out of the product, or you decide you don't want to invest in it anymore, and you don't go to the gym anymore, so guess what? You start back eating crazy, you stop going to the gym, you stop exercising, and now you're back here. But then you're like, well, maybe it's the gym's fault. Maybe it's my trainer's fault. I am going to go find another program down here, okay? So now you're here, and the program's great. You're interested, you're doing well, and so you're here now. And now you're at like month four, when it should have just took you three months to lose those 15 pounds. You're here now, but then um, let's just say you think you need to cut back on your budget, so you take that out, and you're just going to go walk at the park. Well, you kind of go, go, go. You made a little bit of progress, cool. But then you stop because it's the winter or it's raining or whatever. And it's raining, so you decide to eat pizza and tacos and snacks at work. So you gain those 10 pounds back, right? Oh, so we're back here. All right, well, maybe I need to find another program because I saw something that's interesting. So you get distracted again, all right? And then you still don't want to eat right. So this is your progress for the next, let's just say, three weeks. You haven't really made any on the line of success. Now, mind you, it should only took you three months to get here. Only. All righty. So then you find a pill to take. The pill is supposed to be your save all, be all, end all of all your, your results. So let's just say you lose your, 50, your 30 pounds and you're all the way here. All right. You lost your weight. You're good to go. You're like, yes, I made my goal. I made my goal. 
And then you run out and you want to celebrate with food. Hello? You want to celebrate with food, and then next thing you know, a month later, you gain all that weight back, okay? Now, I say all that to say this. This whole thing maybe should have took you, let's just say, three months. Three months of just eating right. Three months of just being consistent with one exercise program. Three months of just being committed and ready to do whatever. But instead, we get distracted with all of this stuff, and we end up all over the place instead of staying on the straight line to success. So if you are doing a workout program right now, or you're dieting, or you're doing a lifestyle change, I challenge you today to stay on the straight line to success. Every opportunity that comes your way is not always the best opportunity to help you reach your goals. So I hope that helped you out. Straight line of success and stay focused, okay? Learn how to say no to all the crazy stuff that comes your way. My name is Dee again from Rock Paper Fitness, and that is your vitamin D 